welcome to my channel once again in this video i'm going to cover how to apply work some app in word document okay it's going to be a step-by-step -step petition the beauty of watermark is that it makes your document look unique okay make it look unique maybe you have a company you know you can create a letter heading with that watermark attached to it the watermark can be a company's logo or just an image or just a text you know or just few text just to explain your brand or to mark your brand so that whenever somebody handles that document you know that this document belongs to such a company so let's get started i will open my word app though it's been a taskbar i can still use the search icon to get to it so i tap on it and tap over type over then click on the app for it to open okay so it's opening now you can see i have some documents already created with this word app okay these are templates you can still use to create a document and then insert the watermark inside okay i can choose blank i can okay let me just work with one of the documents i initially created okay so i will tap on this for it to open now i have here god's wind building material company okay let's see later head uh later head just it's a heading so i can have this as the major title of my document okay then i press the enter button like i will leave it there it doesn't matter when it comes to inserting a watermark okay in a document so the watermark command is found in the design tab by default you are loaded at on the home tab all right so i will click on the design tab okay design tab has opened showing us document formatting color fonts and the other parameters but here our interest is on watermark so i'll click on watermark wait for it to open you can see confidential under confidential we have some samples of watermark you can use we have the option the below it that's uh, more watermarks from microsoft office.com and custom watermark and remove watermark these are different options and commands we can use to you know complete so many tags on watermark so let's work with the confidential one and see how it looks like when it apply the document i can click on it see it has been applied to this document confidential you see so this is just a kind of sample though you can still use it maybe a creating a confidential document but here how do you remove this watermark maybe you are not comfortable with this the only thing you have to do is still click on that watermark then choose the option to remove watermark you are done now what if i want to have a unique watermark in form of text or logo or image is still doable so just to click on the watermark command again then go with the option to custom watermark okay i click on custom watermark if i want to have add text maybe beautiful company or godwin tech company or anything at all i'll click in the text section add the text i want to have and then hit the apply button then I have this document. Okay, text watermark apply to my document. Okay, what if you want to add logo or picture? I you tap on the option for picture watermark. I've selected it now. So under it is select picture. So tap on select picture for your system to open your computer to open or to select any document you want to use. If you want to search being to get an image or from from a file that's browse through your computer or maybe you have the logo in your one drive you can select the option for one drive first now okay 
so you browse through to pick any picture you want to use for the watermark but here i assume that i have a picture in my computer so i'm going to pick the picture from my computer so i'll select the option for from a file let's just hold on for it to open okay my computer has opened the explorer section where i can pick any file okay let's say the feature i want to work with is under download i click on download then i want to use any of these pictures which one is better okay let me go with the second option then click on insert okay then the last option is to either click ok or apply anyone can go apply all right so then i'll close this print watermark dialog box you see the picture now has been applied as watermark you see in this my document so these are just the few steps on how you can add watermark in your document okay if you have any question please feel free to ask please do well to ask subscribe to my channel leave a comment like this video if the other videos you want me to still make on any microsoft ap application feel free to drop in the comment section